Now, throughout the year, we saw some obvious great contenders for some great story experiences. Some for story itself, and some for storytelling. However, this is where Catherine beats them all out for the best story of 2011. The way the game actually combines both story and storytelling together to form a flowing epic soap opera experience is truly mind-boggling. It starts out simple enough, you're pushing and pulling blocks to somehow escape these nightmares, but soon the manic pushing and pulling of blocks becomes all but a side feature to the main epic. Vincent's constant struggle with both of the Catherines is truly a sight to behold. Relationships are tested, loyalties between friends are broken and are skewed, and everything just gets better and better with each night Vincent passes out drunk on his bed. I was playing the game to watch the story, which is a totally new experience for me. I wanted to know why Catherine with a K was so uptight with Vincent, and I wanted to know why this Catherine with a C chick decided to hit on Vincent in the first place. All the characters matter to the storyline, including the bubbly waitress Erica and the creepy old ladies who seem to know a bit too much about the goings-on. I actually found myself screaming at the television like I do at the Maury show during certain pivotal scenes between characters. Combine this with multiple endings, a truly excellent script filled with voice actors who do an amazing job at bringing these unique characters to life, and overall, this game did what others couldn't, and that was to be mainly a service to its truly engaging and interesting story about a man who just had it a little tough.